if he's not coming into must. You see how he's flopped his trunk over his tusk like that? That's indicative of an elephant coming into must. Must, of course, a period of heightened testosterone levels where male elephants feel a deep sense of frustration because they're trying to mate and it's no easy feat for an elephant to find a mate. Chewing something there, Vian. Like Either that or he's grinding his teeth. Doesn't look like he's coming into must. I can't smell anything. He's probably about a 25 year old bull. He's getting to the stage where you'd be fairly wary of him if he turned around and looked at you like that. Now, watch him digging. This is amazing. Now what he's going for is the roots of that bush willow tree. Isn't that amazing? He's seeing if he can find some tubers and he'll break off pieces of the of the roots of the bush willow. And people often ask what is the point of an elephant's toenails? And I think the answer probably is in the digging. Now look, look at that. This is fantastic. See, now the roots, of course, are where these animals, or not these animals, these plants store their nutrients. Which means if you're an elephant, that's a rather good source of nutrition, like a carrot, if you like. Just much harder and less tasty. And you'll see, I think you'll probably find he's not eating the whole thing. He's probably just chewing off the bark. Look at that trunk, it's so dexterous, it's like a little hand. <laughs> he keeps missing his mouth. There we go. I don't, let's see if he swallows the whole thing, if he just chews the bark off the side of it, the outer layers. He's just snapping it. Now that, for you and I, everybody, would not be easy to snap. No, he swallowed it. He swallowed the whole thing. That's interesting. I really didn't think he'd do that. That will pass through his digestive system almost completely intact. Hello Krishna. Nice to hear from you. You say, why does the skin of an elephant look very dry? Krishna, um... Does it? Does it look very dry? I, I think it's just because it doesn't have any fur on it. It's not oily at all, but I don't think it's dry. It's probably, you know what it is? It's the fact that it's so wrinkly, I think, and often it's covered in dust, and that's why it looks so dry. But I don't think it's any drier than any other skin, and I know it's not waterproof, and that means it also doesn't have any sweat glands. And so maybe that's why it looks a little drier. They never sort of sweat. Maybe that's what it is. <laughs>